I don't even know what we're gonna talk about. <laughs> Well, what is up everyone? Welcome back to the Kitchen Table TCG. My name's Louie. Today, Legend Story Studios just tweeted out, literally five minutes ago. Oh my gosh, let me pull up the tweet. They just tweeted out that Crucible of War Unlimited is now out of print. That Crucible of War is not going to be in print any longer. Uh, there are so many things to talk about. First off, um, George and Mitch, I feel like this is gonna be the, the nail in the coffin for our little bet. Uh, if you weren't aware, we had a little bet in the Monarch live stream. Uh, we'll talk about it. We're not gonna call it early. It's at the end of the year. Will Monarch first edition or Crucible be, be worth more money? Uh, so anyway, crazy stuff. Um, bigger news here, and I know that sounded so prideful. I just, I love being right and George being wrong. It doesn't happen that often. Bigger news here is that we have an out of print unlimited set. Uh, Crucible of War, first off, is my favorite set. So like I uh, I will be sad. The other thing, you know, consider is you can't draft this. So it's not super surprising to me that they went out of print with this one. I, I guess I am surprised that it didn't happen with all three of the sets from this block, meaning WTR and ARC and crew. But what this does mean is that WTR and arc could go out of print and now we know that unlimited isn't truly unlimited which i know you're going to leave in the comment section i told you louis this would never happen it's always going to you know they can't keep everything in print it makes sense um i thought that they would never actually announce that and that they would um always keep the opportunity to reprint it if the market needed it so that they can keep the hands um they can keep the cards in the hands of player in the hands of player sorry i this is like big news this is news this is the type of thing that will do something to the market. Uh, it'll jumpstart it or it will, um, or you'll see some movements because of it. Uh, it might not mean more market cap comes into the market, but it will certainly mix things up. And uh, I like when things get mixed up. So it's good for my videos. Um, so Crucible War officially out of print. Here's what they said. As with all flesh and blood cards, cards that were originally printed in Crucible of War may be reprinted in future sets. So, um, you know, that makes sense. That's awesome. Um, Crucible of War is OOP. So let's talk about some things I think the market is going to do really quickly. A, I think that any Crucible of War singles are now um, very, very uh, low priced. Uh, let me tell you why. Currently the unlimited ones and the first edition ones are very close to price. Um, and so it's gonna be interesting to see what happens there. Um, secondly, uh, the EV, this is probably the most important part, the EV for Crucible of War currently is pretty parallel. It's pretty close to a box price, give or take about $100, give or take about 10 to 20%. If you compare that with Arcane Rising or WTR, it's nowhere close. The EV is not anywhere close. So in my mind, um, the singles have a, a lot of room to, um, to, to sorry, I guess the, the singles have a lot of room to move because you're not gonna see these singles. Like, uh, it's just weird. Like the markets already dry on cruise. This is a weird announcement, honestly. Not one that I expected. I think what's gonna happen, my personal opinion, is that the market's gonna move on the singles as a result of there not being that many singles. There's a decent amount of sealed product, uh, but the amount of singles on the market is a very, very low. So I feel like what we're gonna see is another world of arbitrage, where you're gonna see the EV of these boxes. If you watch my EV videos, the EV of these boxes is gonna get back to being an arbitrage, meaning that it's worth it to open the boxes because the singles are more money. Um, and then eventually it'll take the time for the, the sealed product to even out. They did say that there is a wave at distribution um, I know I was able to get some this week from distribution um, and it's, uh, it, you know, they said there's a wave at distribution. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see how big that is. Um, you know, all the product is at distribution. So who knows how many that is. They did not put it on the collector center as of the filming of this video. Uh, it'll be very, very interesting. So what I think this does is it gives a little bit more confidence into unlimited WTR and ARC singles as well, as well as unlimited WTR and ARC sealed product. I think you'll see a little bit more confidence is termed of uh, keeping sealed product. Um, and I think what you're gonna really see is an interesting dynamic between unlimited crew and first edition crew. Uh, we don't have the print run numbers for unlimited crew yet. 
I don't really understand it because earlier James White said that um, that the print run was going to be you know was small and that it was going to not be enough to, to fulfill the market uh, of Crew Unlimited. So I don't feel like we've had a ton of Crew Unlimited hit the market. We know that there are 37,500 boxes of Crew First Edition. What we don't know is what is that number compared to in Unlimited Edition, which is a really really spicy and interesting thought. Um, I don't think that it's less. I think that would be ridiculous. Um, but the print run seems to be very, very small in comparison. I think the print run of Crew Unlimited is much smaller than the print run of WTR or Arc Unlimited. Um, much, much smaller. Um, so it's going to be very interesting to see if they release those numbers. Uh, the, the EV, this doesn't make any sense. The EV of Crucible Unlimited right now is like... 80 bucks, 85 bucks. It's ridiculous. Um, so it doesn't make a ton of sense, although I think it is going to do crazy things to the market. So wanted to share this video. If you didn't catch the news, let me know what you think in the comment section below. Uh, give me all your thoughts, all the things that I'm wrong about, right about. I'm very curious to see how the community reacts to this news. Uh, Crucible of War will never see a reprint. Um, that's crazy. Uh, man, I've been talking about Crucible of War a lot. It's crazy. Crazy. Hope you have a great day. Remember to be kind to the people around you. I appreciate you. Thank you for supporting this content.